in my sister's bedroom right now. And as you can see, it's quite a bit messy actually. My room actually tidier than my sister's room for once, which is absolutely crazy because usually my sister's room is way cleaner than mine. But I actually tidied up my room for this video because today I am going to be doing a room tour. And if you guys don't already know this, I am currently staying in LA in Hollywood, which is absolutely crazy. So today I'm going to be doing a Hollywood detailed room tour because on the Family Fist channel, make sure to subscribe to Family Fist. Also make sure to subscribe to this channel. But yeah, on Family Fizz, we did a whole entire house tour with all me and my family all over the house, the Hollywood house. So if you wanna watch that, I definitely recommend go watching it if you haven't already. But today I'm going to be doing like a detailed room tour because I didn't really go into much detail of just my room. So today I'm going to be going through all of my rooms. So enough of me rambling. Without further ado, let's get on to the room tour. So here is the door to my room and when you come in the first thing you see is my bed and these are my pillows which are super super comfy these are like the comfiest pillows i have ever had and it has this really 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 nice mattress i really do love this mattress it's not as good as my mattress at home but it's still really good and i get to sleep like really good then there's actually like a sheet that you can sleep under here but i haven't ever used that this is the duvet that i have and and look at this really nice and fit and I actually have a double bed which is super nice because at home I only have a single bed so like the other day I was like sleeping and then I was only sleeping on like one side and then I could like roll over and it's really nice to be able to do that because usually I can't do that at home then next to my bed I have a bedside cabinet here which is really really nice I couldn't actually work out how to like work this light like when it came into the place this light was turned on but then I couldn't work out how to turn it off so I literally just had to like pull out of the wall I actually let's see it's a really nice lamp though I do really like this then I have my two books which I've been reading I've got two books and this is my first book it's by Saffron Barker and I've actually finished all of this it was really really good Mia Corns. I definitely recommend that you guys read it and then I've also got this second book called I Am Malala and I have actually like quite a bit through like as you can see I am quite a fast reader so yeah this is why I don't usually get like physical books and I just usually read like ebooks because I find if not like I'll just go through them so quickly and it's just like I don't like to read the same book twice anyways these are really good books I definitely recommend you get them guys if you're looking for some books and then I have my sunglasses case on top of here and as you guys know I absolutely love these sunglasses then after my bed and my bedside cabinet I have this little cupboard which I don't really go into often like I didn't really even notice this like my sister actually had to tell me about this like I didn't even like know this existed in my room <laughs> but yeah, in here, it's like this little cupboard thing. Oh, by the way, Mia Corns, the reason why all the lights are turned on, like, by the way, I don't usually just leave lights on in my room. The only reason why all the lights are on, like, now is just because for this room tour, of course. But don't worry, I don't leave the lights on just, like, on for no reason at all. <laughs> so yeah, in here is this weird, like, cupboard thing, which I don't really know why they have it. And then here they have a cupboard inside a cupboard which is very strange and i don't know if it's an american thing i'm not really sure if this is like an american thing or not but this is like what you usually have like under the stairs but like it's not usually inside another cupboard then i have these two really really super comfy seats really nice you can look out into the window this is my view from my window it's not actually the best view i'd say my parents actually have the best view because they have really really big windows and really really nice but yeah i actually do quite like this view though it's quite Quite pretty like just the palm trees and stuff then over here I have this really nice little silver table and it has this like succulent on it but it's not actually a real succulent it just looks like one it's a candle which I think is really really cool I don't know what scent this is though I haven't actually ever tried sniffing it it doesn't really have a scent to be honest then over here I have another chair and this one has a really pretty blue cushion I really wish I could just put this in my suitcase and take it home with me it's so nice but anyways, I can't do that because that would be stealing <laughs> and it has another one of these really nice white chairs Then over here. I have my own 
Oh my gosh, Miracles. I think this is one of the things I was most excited about. I have my own ensuite. En suite, en suite. Um, I think it's en suite. <laughs> I always get confused between whether it's en suite or en suite because I think it's spelt like en suite, but you actually say en suite. I think it was like a French word or something. <laughs> but yeah, in every single room, it has an en suite bathroom, which I, is absolutely crazy because like even the living room has a bathroom on it, which is like normal, but then like so does all the other like all the rooms and everything it, it, it just blows my mind I feel like that's a really American thing to have like an ensuite bathroom for everyone so yeah here's my ensuite bathroom inside here it's a very nice bathroom I really like having my own bathroom by the way because it's like my favorite thing in the whole entire universe like literally I want to get an ensuite bathroom for my room at home so over here I have this pile of towels then I have these two little like I think these ones are fake succulents, but these ones aren't candles. Then I have another one of those candle succulent things. And I have another pile of towels. Then I have my sink here, which is very, very nice. I really like this sink. It's quite big as well, and it has like, this one's cold, and this one's hot. I don't know, I feel like usually they're the other way around. Don't know why. Um, then I have another pile of towels, because you know, you can never have too many towels, me acorn. Then I have this little bar of soap, which is actually from Trader Joe's. On my camera, you can't see it, but I actually just says Trader Joe's on here which is really cool. I don't know why I like this bar of soap. It's just like my favorite bar of soap ever just because it says Trader Joe on it. Then I have another one of those candle succulent things for no reason at all. It just looks cool. Then I have my Instagirl case thing and then I have my makeup bag which says embrace your inner unicorn on it. Always remember to do that unicorns. Very true. Then in here I have a drawer full of just my jewelry, just a random bag which I got off the plane. I have some toothbrushes in here. I got some sun cream, some deodorant, a hairbrush, and then over here I have another drawer which I keep my technology in. I know that's a bit weird to keep like technology in your bathroom, but I couldn't find any other drawers. And like I've been too careful not to get it wet. By the way, mirror cords. Then here, over here I have this really nice big mirror which I've been doing my makeup in. It's been really really nice just having like this massive mirror. Look at me compared to this mirror miracles <laughs> then over here behind me i have the two these two towel racks so one towel here I have another towel here which i absolutely love having loads and loads of towels by the way miracles all of these towels are super soft as well i don't know why they're just really soft compared to like the ones at home then over here i have my toilet but let's not go into too much detail because it's just a, it's it's just a toilet then over here i have a little mat thing which i thought is really funny because it looks kind of reminds me a bit of like sea anemone is that how you say it? Anonymy or na anonymy? I always get confused. I don't know how to say it, but it's like those little things that you get on rocks in the sea. I don't know. I think they bite you or something. You have to be super careful of them. I'm not entirely sure. But I can never say that word. Anonymy, anonymy, anonymy. Is that how you say it, Because How do you say it? Like, do you guys even know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I'm probably just like made up this random word creature thing. <laughs> Anyways, over here I have my shower slash bath. I did actually have a bath in here the other day, which was was really weird but every morning I've been having a shower in here but it's just really funny because this bath is just like the weirdest bath I have ever seen and it's like really small as well like I was just sitting here like this and it's just like really small and really funny <laughs> it just looks so weird miracles look at it so this is um this is it has the weirdest things ever like it doesn't have like a plug thing that you put inside is that an American thing but basically that closes it and that leaves it open. Then I have this thing and you have to pull this up. Like I got really confused of how to use this shower because the one at home in England, so easy to use. It's just the easiest thing in the whole entire world. This one's really complicated. You have to pull this out and then you have to twist it for the temperature you want. And then you, if that will come out of this bit and then you have to pull this up for um, it to be a shower, for it to come out of the shower. I feel like even the shower looks really funny. I don't know why. This is just like, just Look at this vehicle, it's just the funniest thing ever. Then over here, I have my shampoo and conditioner from 
Trader Joe's. Then I have my body wash from Trader Joe's. Oh my gosh, Mia Corns. I've been trying to do an American accent, but like even though I'm here in America, I still can't do an American accent. <laughs> and then up here I have another window, which actually has a really nice view if you like Mia Corns. What do you think of it? It's really pretty. There's loads of like jungle leaf flowers and things like that. <laughs> then coming out of my bathroom. Oh, actually, I forgot to show you this. There's some really weird like tiles. I don't know what color this is. It's like a jade green and then some weird stuff. Yeah. <laughs> then the last thing in my room is my wardrobe. And I absolutely love my wardrobe neocorns. It actually has a light, which I only just discovered. Like, I didn't even notice this for ages. But then, like, when I was looking for lights just to make this room a bit lighter for, the, for this room tour for you guys, I realized it actually has a light, which is pretty cool. So in here is my wardrobe. Down here I have my suitcase. I have my hat, I have some of my swimming costumes, some underwear, I have my things I've been using pajamas. Oh my gosh, meacorns. Funny story. Basically, I haven't, like, I don't know how, but like, before we left, I had like a pile of clothes already for like going here, and I couldn't, like, I had my like pajama top in there and my sports bra in the pile, but for some reason, I got here and I realized I only have my pajama bottoms and not my top or my sports bra, which was really annoying. So I've actually just been using this jumper, which is actually not supposed to be pajamas then over here i have my shorts and my jeans i do have another pair of jeans here and i think i do have some leggings as well but that's in the wash then i have my two jackets oh my gosh another funny story mia corns so the day before we left i got my nails done actually talking about my nails they are a bit chipped because i went in the bath the other day that was not a good idea because it makes your nail brush fall off spending like an hour in hot water but oh well yeah so um basically i got my nails done the day before we left and then for some reason I decided to clean my shoes which was not a very good idea so it chipped my nail polish so the day we left like the morning because we didn't leave until like 11 o'clock or something so I went to get my nails done just for them to like fix it for me and yeah basically what happened was I got to like we were supposed to leave at 11 but like I was still in the nail salon at like 11 20 so I went to the nail salon with this coat on and I wasn't supposed to bring this coat to America but basically we were in like a massive Massive rush because I spent so long in the nail salon. So I was supposed to go home from the nail salon and then we were supposed to leave, but basically they had to come and pick me up in the car from the nail salon. Then I have my coat, which I was actually supposed to bring, which is a lot thinner. Then I have all my t-shirts. I have actually, like, I got some new clothes for um, this trip and I'm absolutely loving it. I've got some really nice stuff. So I've got this top here. I think that's from New Look. This one's from New Look. A lot of these clothes are from New Look, by the way, Mia Corns. Yeah, I feel like this is from New Look. Yeah, this is from New Look. New Look. New look, new look, new look. This one's from H&M. <laughs> and then this one's from new look as well. <laughs> this is a dress which I've actually, like, I wasn't sure about this because basically my dad did Dad Buys Daughter's Outfits Challenge. And, yeah, basically he chose this for me. And I wasn't sure about it. But I actually really like it, Mirkorns. What do you think of it? I wore it the other day. I really loved it. <laughs> and then over here I've also got my hat, which I think is from River Island. It's from River Island? Yeah, I think so. But it's really cool because it's, like, glittery and holographic and it has a unicorn on it of course so yeah that's all for my wardrobe let's turn off the light oh my gosh they have the nicest wardrobe doors it's like two massive mirrors which is really good for like when you're trying on your outfit you're like hmm does this look okay and you can look in the mirror and like it's it's just super cool mirrors i just oh i love it and then over here the last thing i have in my room is this painting of some sort of bird i feel like it's a stork not entirely sure mirrors i'm no bird expert then it has some yellow flowers, which are really pretty. These are absolutely massive. Compare that to the size of the bird's head. Like, what? Why is the flower so big? And then it's like it's a sort of like lake thing. Yeah, it's a bit weird. <laughs> so there you go, guys. This is all of my room tour. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure to click subscribe to become a Mirkon. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Oh guys, make sure to follow me on Instagram as well at Mia's Life Official because I've been doing way, way, way more like posts and stories and things. Like I haven't been too active on my YouTube channel, but I'm gonna be start doing more videos on here, don't worry. But I've been super active on Instagram, so make sure to follow me on Instagram.